additional company, either an engine or a ladder, that stands vigilant. Experience has shown that this team must be properly trained to rescue trapped firefighters. This RIC concept is mandated by federal law and has saved many firefighters' lives. Sadly, though, lack of specialized training and inadequate staffing has left these critical positions in many departments unfilled or ineffective. It doesn't matter what type of city, town, or department you're from, even if your community runs one fire a year or 600, the number of firefighters required to fight a fire does not change. It is our citizens and elected representatives' responsibility to support your local fire department. There are always four components that help dictate the outcome of a fire. Training, technology, notification of alarm, and staffing. Medical personnel should stand by at every fire for both citizens and firefighters. New technology such as the Cobb allows medics to determine on scene whether a victim or a firefighter has been exposed to toxic gases. This non-invasive diagnostic tool helps EMTs and doctors make treatment decisions while reinforcing the need for firefighters to wear breathing apparatus at all stages of the fire. At the end of the incident, all companies operating on scene should perform a critique of the operations. Hi, my name is Bobby Halton. I'm the editor-in-chief of Fire Engineering Magazine, and you've just finished watching Smoke Showing, a video produced by Frank Ritchie, dedicated to the memory of the late Tom Brennan. Tom Brennan was a great friend of fire engineering, former editor, and an FDMY firefighter. The tactics shown in this video were derived from Tom Brennan's 17 years of writing the Random Thoughts column. The tactics shown in the video, however, were shown to you incrementally or chronologically. In real life, you'd want those tactics to happen simultaneously in order to ensure firefighter safety and survival on the fire ground. Tactics are the building blocks of every single fire attack. We hope that you enjoyed this video, and we'd like to thank our partners, the Hartford Insurance Company and the Williams Dryer Company of Vancouver, Canada, for helping us to produce this free video to all firefighters. Please feel free to download it, reproduce it in any way you feel fit to help train firefighters to be safer and to have a safer day. Thank you again for supporting fire engineering, and thank you for all that you do. Thank you.